everybody, welcome to Tokyo Creative Play. I am your host Emma and today I'm here with Kim and Shala. Hi. Today we are going on a day trip around Tokyo and we're going to be using the Toei One Day yeah. Pass. It's only 700 yen and you can travel on all Toei lines and even the Toei buses. So we're just going to be traveling around for a day, seeing what fun activities we can do and just enjoying it on the One Day Pass. Let's do it! Let's go! <laughs> Alright guys, so we've made our first stop here in Asakusa at Yae and we're gonna choose some kimono. We're gonna put on kimono for the day and kind of like walk around. So there's so many to choose from. I can't wait to see what they have. So let's go. I think I'm gonna go with this one because it has the same flowers as my new tattoo. I like the colors. I like really dark kimono. I think that they look really classy and stylish. All right, so we've chosen our kimono and we're gonna go downstairs to the second floor and they're gonna help us get dressed. Okay, I can't really face you guys to tell you this, but um, this place is really English friendly. Everyone's just been chatting to us in really great English so far, so if you guys don't speak Japanese, it's perfect to come here because it's really, really easy. And I love this kimono so much. It's such a different style than what I would usually go for, but it's so cool. Just doing my hair now, so I chose to do the side ponytail. So yeah, the process is really easy. You go, you choose your kimono, they will put it on for you, and then you get to pick what hairstyle you want. Um, they've got like a few different ones you can choose from. They're all really nice looking, so. Yeah, um, it's gonna be really exciting to walk around in like kimonos afterwards. They're just doing my hair now, and next I get to choose which hair accessories I wanna add in. It's really fun because you can customize your entire outfit. You get to choose the obi, the bag, the decorations, the hair accessories. It's really cool to like choose what you wanna do and make your own original kimono design. We're all finished, and we are gonna go get some lunch now because we're starving. So hungry. But we look really cool. Yeah, look at us. Yeah. That was really fun. This is the first time I've worn kimono with my friends. I've Aww. only done it once for graduation, so, so this cute. is cool. Okay. Hell yeah. Food time, okay, Food I'm starving. <laughs> we found this place that has soba, tempura, udon, so that's perfect. It's gonna be warm to warm us up yes. in this <laughs> weather. Let's go in. Okay, so our meals have arrived. We both got a veggie tempura yeah, set with some soba. So and then Kim got Total. that nasty piece of something. Oh, <laughs> it's good stuff, man. Shall we? Let's, let's, let's dig in. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. Mm, this is really good. This is so good. Oh, here. <laughs>
in Kudamai now and we're gonna do some shopping. Apparently this is kind of like an oshade, like a fancy area where people like to go to cafes and shop for like traditional slash modern Japanese goods. It's like a combination of the two. So we're gonna see what we can find. Okay, so we just came to Kuramae and we've decided to come to this shop called Consento or Consent and it's taken this like kind of theme of like traditional Japanese things but turn them a bit modern and it's really nice, very oshare which is like fashionable or fancy. They have coffee and there's some really cool things here so we're gonna check them out. Oh, look at these guys. I really wanna try it. Am I gonna get in trouble? Oh no, I'm scared. I don't know how to do it. <gasps> Did you guys see that? <laughs> it's just a pencil. If you take it to the class, it's gonna piss off everyone, right? Yeah. Oh, you can like whack someone in the face with this. Alright, so we're here now at Azabu Yasai Gashi. Yasai means vegetables and gashi means like sweets. Yeah, uh, snacks. snacks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and so this place does like traditional Japanese sweets, or not so traditional, but they make them with vegetables, which is a really interesting take. They have like cakes here made out of tomato. 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 Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to be trying some things here, having a little taste, but I'm, excited. I'm, I'm intrigued. There's so many colorful things to choose yeah. from. They're all really interesting. Yeah. This is cheesecake made out of eggplants. <laughs> It looks really good. It looks really good. Really good. Look at how colorful this is. Yeah. Okay, so we've got our food. Um, I'll go first. I have wadabi mochi, which has green tea but also spinach mixed in with it. So, interested to try that. <laughs> <laughs> I got the oshiruko, which is normally a red bean soup. Um, which is, I guess, also a vegetable kind of. But oh, yeah. today it's made with purple potatoes. It's very colorful. And the mochi are each made from a different kind of vegetable. So spinach, pumpkin, sesame, and tomato. So <laughs> that'll be an experience. Yeah. It smells amazing though. And I got the eggplant cheesecake, which is really interesting <laughs> because- Super you interesting. Don't, you don't think eggplant is sweet, right? No. But apparently this is going to be sweet. So yeah. that's really cool. So it doesn't sound that great, but I'm sure it's going to be delicious. It said on the menu that they kind of like stew the eggplants in wine yeah. and then they taste like apples. Yeah. So that sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> It actually tastes like wine. Really? really? Yeah, it tastes like wine, but it's really sweet. It doesn't Not taste like anything at all, but it's really good. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm, this is good. Mm. This shop is great. This is really good. That was so good. It was really good. It was really good. I'm thoroughly impressed. Yeah. I'll be back for sure. I really yeah. want to go back for that sweet potato soup. Oh yeah, I'll awesome. want that next time. Yeah. That was good. All right, so from here, we are headed to Shinjuku. Shinjuku. Okay. For gyoza. Oh, yes. veggie gyoza. Last stop in Shinjuku, and Ooh. we're gonna get some dinner now. We are going yeah. to Bia Loves Gyoza. Apparently, this place they have some vegetarian gyoza, which is so really rare. Yeah, yeah, really rare in Tokyo. So it's great if you guys are vegan, vegetarian. So yeah. there's food options for you. So we're gonna go in, have some food, have some drinks to finish off the night. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! yeah. yeah. Oh, 
so many I want to try. Um, they got a great menu. There's so many yeah, different like you... veggie options. I'm surprised. They have mabo dofu here, um, which is usually made with ground meat, but they did it with soy meat. So that's really cool. I've never seen uh, like a vegetarian mabo dofu in a Japanese restaurant before, and it's one of my favorite dishes. So I'm super excited about that. That's really good. Really good. Mm. Oh, it's fried to perfection. Damn. Yeah. If anyone wants kimchi, chaha. Oh. Mm. Not that spicy, but it's good. Oh, that's so good. This one's delicious. It's got like a spicy mayo and seaweed and green onions topping. So good. <laughs> All right, so I have an okonomiyaki gyoza here. This is also the soy meat one. So okonomiyaki is a completely different dish, but I think they've put okonomiyaki sauce and mayonnaise and bonito flakes on it. So we'll see how it holds up. Tastes like okonomiyaki. <laughs> All right, so we just finished our day traveling along the Toei lines. It was awesome. There were so many places that we went to, but we didn't get to go to everywhere on the Toei lines. That would be impossible to do in a day. So there's actually lots more places that you can check out on the Toei lines. My favorite place is actually one of the lines is a tram. It's like one of the only trams in Tokyo, the Toei Arakawa line. I don't think I've ever been on. It's really cute. It's like a really like hometowny, like old Aww. traditional yeah. feeling as you go on this little tram. It's super cute. It's in Adakamaku if you want to check it out. Do you guys have any favorite places on the Toei lines? I actually used to live on the Toei Oedo line and my favorite oh. cat cafe uh, is at Shin Ekora Station. It's called Ekoneko and they oh, have cute. lots of rescue cats that they've like oh. nursed back to health and they're all super friendly and they love the visitors so definitely check that out. That's really yeah. cool. For me recently my most favorite place is Rupongi because there's so much to do there. Nightlife is great and all the restaurants there. There are so many cafes, uh, food is great, there's so much to do so I definitely recommend you go check that out. It's close to Tokyo Tower too. So we just want to say thank you to the Toy Line for sponsoring this video and sponsoring our fun day out. If you guys do end up coming to Tokyo definitely check out the one day pass it is only 700 yen and you can travel in all Toei lines out of all the places we went today if you could pick one where would you like to visit let us know let us know in the comments down below but thank you so much for watching and thanks you guys for coming on thanks the stage with me thanks for inviting me no worries and we'll see you guys in a video sometime soon bye, bye.